watching CI Living at home in your community. Hey, it's me, Joe, uh, Joe Barlow. Still rocking my CI Living hat. Boy, 10 years. <laughs> so many fun memories. Uh, can't can't remember them, but there's so many. Um, and I, I, I remember when I left the show, I was on the show for four years, and, and people said, you know, how are they gonna keep the show going without you? And that was my mom, she asked that, and it was nice of her, but, but then, uh, you know, you, you found some great subsequent storytellers, Ryan and Aaron, excellent work, and then people started telling me that the show's actually never been better. And I thought that was offensive, and that was also my mom. So. Congratulations on 10 years, you did it without me. I mean, I was there for four and I kind of helped, but uh, 10 years, gee, gee whiz, I haven't aged. I still have smooth skin and no gray hairs. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> Heather, call me. <laughs> That was great. That was so oh funny. Word. I never worked with Joe, but I really wish I would. Oh my oh, word! Hysterical. Today has been the best day ever, and it's only getting better because now my ex-husband <laughs> is here with us. But, we're, but we're, we're the best of exes. Right? Absolutely. So get along really well. Yes. Uh, Matt Metcalf back in the building. Welcome home. Thank you. I, I barely recognize it, and right? I have to say I resent having to bribe the doorman to get into your urban law. <laughs> Right, well, all right, so, but I'm glad I'm here, I, and I wouldn't miss it, truly. Ten years is really something incredible. Um, and you think about this studio, with a, you know, I'm the history geek, so I just want to, as the unofficial historian here, this studio has been the home to The Hop, to um, Illinois Journal, to uh, tons of shows, it's Sheriff Sid. I mean, this is where, and the news at times. And so the fact that this has a new chapter, is really remarkable. We talked with Judy just a week or so ago, and she used to do the telethons in here, all sorts of things that uh, that happen yeah. right in this space, and of course, look nothing like it does now. Do you yeah. think it's haunted? Have you ever had a weird <laughs> occurrence, an unexplained not, phenomenon? But former employees have said they have mm. weird things in the what? basement. Yeah. Yeah, oh my word. that probably in a very special episode. I'm of glad I yeah, living know that. In the basement, I, we interviewed a medium back when we did the Halloween spooktacular. Movie yeah, the movie marathon. <laughs> we actually had a medium come in and do a reading, and she didn't. She didn't feel like anyone was hanging around, but okay, maybe they weren't. That's there. a good sign. That's <laughs> one fun memory. But what are some of your favorite moments? <laughs> well, it, it, seeing Joe just made me laugh, yes. like instantly, because he would always have these off-the-cuff comments that would just kind of come out of nowhere. <laughs> but, you know, I think about all of the things that we did on television, I think back to our Route 66 show, and I think you were off that I day. was off that day. It, it was crazy. So me and Joe are on this bus, <laughs> and we're going down, and Nancy, right, because we are doing <laughs> 60 minutes from the time the bus pulls away to having to show up in our town. Yeah, and that sounds like a logistical. Yeah, it for was. Sure. It was, but 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 I mean, we hit all the stops. Yeah. I mean, and there were stops along the way where we're doing wow. segments. The thing was live on the bus. The <laughs> and we we think it may have been the first mob live mobile TV show. For sure, that was, was done. It was remarkable. Incredible. We, we pitch that now. Everybody's lived long enough to go, that's not happening. <laughs> <laughs> no way. <laughs> I'm glad you were brave enough to pull that one off. Yeah, yeah. Trailblazer. It was remarkable. And, and there's so many memories. I mean, I, you think about, like, and you guys all have your own special memories, and, and every time is unique into itself. And there's fun memories between you and your fellow co-hosts, such as this one that we see here. Um, <laughs> yeah, so this is the end of the show. <laughs> and my goodness, yeah, we're about to try oh some. Oh, my word. Um, yeah, and there we go. We're eating kimchi. She. It was <sighs> awful. Like I don't Maria even. Maria tried even to kill us. Just didn't taste good. Yeah, kimchi. Uh, it, it was so no, hot. No, no, no. Look at our face. We are dying. Yep. Our faces immediately turned I'm like crying. five shades of red. <laughs> it was. It had so much crushed red pepper in it. We yeah. were dying. Well, and, and I laughed afterwards because they're just rolling the credits like it's the end of the show. They're collapsing. Right. Yeah, be well, that's <laughs> why it was the end of the show. The news is next. Like, right. 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 Yeah, exactly. We have to get. We're running out of time, but we have to get oh, to. No. Uh, you're known for many things, having been on the show, and I remember when I first started <laughs> going, good? I can never, I cannot keep up with, with the, the sweater vests and the ties, Yes. but the hair... So many different, uh, it few. evolves. There's okay. been a few it, styles. It does. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Yep. Yeah, the parade of hair. Yeah. Oh, that's where it was dyed, <laughs> and it's getting longer, yeah. <laughs> Even longer there well, still. Poofier, poofier up at the top. Yeah, it was... Uh,
<laughs> yeah, I was trying for a man bun at one point, and my hair just doesn't do that. It did, though. It did do that. Off air. It never did it when it, when it, needed, when it counted for television. But, I mean, how fun. I mean, you think about all the great things over the years, like the things that we're eating, that, I mean, that our cooks. The, the unsung heroes of this show are not only our, our team, they're, they're working production behind the scenes, but also our semi-regulars, the Lisa Louis Shields of the world. We heard from Anita, you know, Chuck and Pam. Right. Yeah. I mean, those are the folks that are regularly bringing it every time they come on the show to make a difference to our viewers here in central Illinois. This is a special show, and I'm so thank you for having me and allowing me to be a part of well, this. Well, thank you for coming anytime. back. Absolutely. Yeah, and kudos to Nancy, the producer, for 10 years. I mean, that really, yeah. that's something. Yeah. A few of us have been around for 10 years. I know, right? <laughs>